So today's video is about the nitric oxide dump. This was a workout created by MD and triple board certified Dr. Zach Bush. And his research has been absolutely fascinating. This is something that I've picked up just in the last several weeks and started implementing in my life. And I can already tell within three weeks that it's radically changed my health and radically changed my energy level. So I wanted to share this with you guys. It's, it's called the nitric oxide dump. And what nitric oxide is, it's a natural gas that's formed in our body and it actually decreases as we age and when we have good nitric oxide levels it is a free radical and a lot of people think free radicals are the worst things in the world but we're supposed to have some levels of free radicals and this nitric oxide is actually lined in our endothelial part of our blood vessels so the outside layer of our blood vessels and it's released to help the mitochondria in our body in our cells function at a higher level so as we age we start losing the ability to release more nitric oxide and so our mitochondria, our cells, they suffer from that. So what I'm gonna go share with you guys is that there's been studies with this workout that has shown that it helps decrease the probability of dementia, it helps with weight loss, it helps with mitochondrial uh, angiogenesis and metabolism. It helps your mitochondria function at a higher level. It helps your cells function at a higher level, giving you more energy, more vitality, and it's been shown to dramatically help people's health and promote vitality. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you guys the, the different kind of moves. It's all about nasal breathing. What you're gonna do is, you're you're gonna keep your mouth closed. And again, guys, this is about a four minute workout. So this is a high intensity four minute workout that can have huge results. So I definitely want you guys to try it. So I'm gonna talk a little bit about it and then I'm gonna show you guys the moves and then hopefully you guys will do it as well. So we're gonna close our mouth. This is completely closed. I'm gonna open my mouth because I have to talk to you guys. But you're gonna go all nasal breathing and your body is going to be moving and your energy is gonna start moving up and the heat's gonna start building up in your body and your mind's gonna say, I can't breathe, but I promise you, you guys can breathe. You just have to breathe through your nose. You have to start training that. So, breathing through your nose in and out throughout the entire workout. And it's based on four different moves this workout is. So the first move is a squat. So you're gonna squat just like this and bring your hands out like this right here. And then you're gonna do 10 of those. The first time you do it, I want you to do 10 of those. So I'm just gonna go through the moves real quick. So the first part is the squat. The second part of this move is the no jump jumping jacks. So you're gonna go just like this. So it's a jumping jack without jumping. So you move your hands just like this. The third move is alternating hand swings. And again, all nasal breathing. And you go 10 each side. And then the last move is you put your hands just like this. You pretend you have a big weight or the world on top of your, on top of your hands and you do a shoulder press. Now, I know what you may be thinking. Matt, that looks very simple. How is that gonna be a workout? I promise you, get through the first or second round of doing, uh, getting into this point, and you're gonna feel it. And what's gonna happen is you're gonna start increasing heat in your body, you're gonna take in more oxygen, your body's gonna start releasing this nitric oxide, heat's gonna build up in your body, and this has been shown over you know, a long period of time doing these workouts that you can absolutely help your cells to start functioning higher, your mitochondria start functioning more efficiently, and it actually slows down the aging process. So try this out, guys. First time, first couple times you do it, I would say do it 10, set, uh, 10 reps and then to do all the sets. And the next time you do it, maybe the second or third time, start doing 15 and eventually you can get up to 20 reps for each one and you're gonna do four sets of them. And you can do it once a day or twice a day or three times a day. I recommend going once a day and going there, seeing how your body feels. You're gonna feel sore. But again, when we talk about habits, doing it every single day, start with the 10 reps for four sets and then the next day do it again and when you feel good with that go on a 15 and then eventually 20.